Hmm. How are you? How are you? I'm fine. Thank you for asking. How about you? I'm also good, like you, sir. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. And ma'am, uh, so, may first, uh, hmm. please introduce yourself. Okay. So, sir, my name is Neetu. I am from Delhi. I am 23 years old. I, if I am talking about my education, I have completed my 12th class only. When I was doing my graduation at that time, I got married, so I don't, I didn't complete my graduation. And now I am a housewife. I have a one kid. Now, if if I am talking about my hobbies, my hobbies are listening music, dancing, and visiting some uh, places. So that's all about me. Thank you for listening to me. Now it's your turn to yes. introduce yourself. Yes, yes, yes. this is nice. Mm -hmm. to also. And first of all, thank you for giving this opportunity to introduce myself. I am Santanu Das. I am from West Bengal. Uh, by profession, I am working person, and I work in a hospital as an attendant. And if I talk about my education mm. qualification, I have completed my graduation in mathematics subject. And if I talk about my hobbies, I always like playing cricket and football. That, uh, apart from mm. so I am running my one YouTube channel, which name is English with SD. That's all about me, ma'am. Mm. So how is your channel is going? Yeah, right now it's okay. It is going on very good. No problem. There is no problem. <laughs> <laughs> so how's your English journey is going? It's going smooth or it's going so difficult? Yes, uh, it is so difficult actually. I am a working person. I am married person also. Yeah, I have a lot of work in my family, and uh, I, I don't uh, I don't uh, give uh, don't get uh, enough free time also. But uh, whenever I get free time also, I talk to another people, and uh, also mm. I'm very busy. Yeah. Right. So, sir, uh, may I know? May I? I want to know. You are doing a job, good job. So, why are you improving your English? Yes, yeah. <clears throat> Actually, English is an international language as well as the communication language. To communicate each other, to communicate other country of people, English is necessary. English is a needful language also. <clears throat> hmm. And I know also you are from Delhi. You you are from Delhi. You have a you have a own native language. But I did not know hmm. uh, what is your native language also. And uh, I am from West Bengal. I have another native language. But uh, right now, also after learning English, also we are talking each other. We are connecting each other. That's why also English is a connected language. And on the other mm. hand, also whenever you go to the interview for taking a good job in a multinational company, uh, first of all, the interviewer asks the question in English. That's why also English is very necessary and needful language also right now. And I am uh, I am learning English because there is, there is a reason. Because when I was starting in my school life, when I was starting in my in class eight standard and nine standard, that time my English was not good. At that time also, I I was very weak in English subject. At that time also, I always care of the English subject. At that time also, I always take, uh, uh, I took the, uh, as a language, uh, as a subject, yeah, <laughs> in, mm -hmm. in, in my study. It, it was very bad. And right now also, I am working person. And whenever I get free time, I always try to learn English. In this time also, I can write properly. There is no problem in my writing, yeah. And I, I have been learning English for a long time, for one year. and But I have been speaking English about six months. But right now also I am speaking as a broken broken English also I know properly and every single day mm -hmm. I talk to another people for, for my improving my English skill day by day. Right, right, right. That's how you are improving your English. And ma'am, uh, you are speaking very well. But uh, when did you start your English speaking journey? I started my English journey seven months ago. Hmm. Seven months. And so did you join any coaching centers before? Yes, I took before marriage. I took uh, tuition classes, but now I didn't take any tuition classes. Right now, I am just using my YouTube as a uh, partner, like. Yes, yes, yes. Hmm. And uh, right now, also you are you have a you are a housewife. You have a lot of work in your family. You have one kid also. Uh, and right, mm -hmm. right now, also you are learning English and you have been running your YouTube channel. But how do you manage your time? You know, I am staying with my uh, husband, also, so I don't have that much work to do. But uh, if uh, now I have a one kid, so I have to handle him also. So if now if he is sleeping, so I can do one more, one and two conversations, so I can uh, make my English easy. So that's how I am do, uh, doing uh, to improve my English. Yeah, yeah. And ma'am, when you started your English speaking journey, journey, that time also, what kind of method uh, did you follow for your improving your English skill? 
at the time uh, i just i want to only uh, i want to focus on my listening part and and the second hand i want to improve my speaking part so two two secrets i <laughs> want to share to everyone <laughs> yes yes you are right also you are right because i don't like reading the most important part ha uh, i don't like reading uh, if i if I, i if i get a book so i get bored easily and at that time i get sleepy <laughs> yes okay yes. Huh. Like reading also, but whenever I get free time, I always the watch the YouTube video in English. That time also I was I was with subtitle, yeah. And at hmm. that time also I I I do two words. One is listening, another also is uh, reading. Yeah. Yes. So, do you love movie? Yes, uh, I like watching movie. Okay. So which which movie do you like most? Yeah, I belong to I belong to West Bengal. My native language is Bengali. I always like also I always like Bengali movie. Okay. <laughs> It is this is totally different from my Bollywood. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I I always uh-huh. like a comedian movie. Yeah. Hmm, okay. All right, good. And mama, do you like okay. watching movie? Yes, nowadays I don't know how, but uh, nowadays I am watching a lot of movies. Now Hira Mandi is coming and Animal. A lot, a lot of movies are coming right now, so I love to watch. Okay. And then, uh, uh, and uh, do you do you watch a Hindi movie or another another movie? No, no, I love watch Hindi movies, Bollywood, Bollywood movie. I love to watch. Okay, okay. And then, uh, what do you do in your spare time? in spare time i love to do more and more conversation because i want to uh, i want to uh, utilize my time yes yes hmm to improve my, my skill mm-hmm. do you do you like traveling i love traveling but it's it's impossible me for now because now i have a one kid now he is one and half so and now if you will go outside so there is a lot of heat so Yes, yes. It's, And how hmm. is the weather? How is the weather in your locality? It is very heat now. Outside that there is a lot of heat. You cannot go nine days out outside of your house. Oh yes, yes, yes. The yes. summer season is going on. Temperature is very high. Yeah, temperature is increasing hmm. day by day. Day by day. And do you like summer season? Do you like summer season? I don't like summers. <laughs> I love winter season. Oh uh, yeah, but why? What is the reason? There is no any reason. Just I love to winter season. You can eat mumphali gajar ka halwa. You can eat in in winter season, and in winter season you don't feel uh, like itching. You don't feel uh, any kind of like I don't want to be suffer in summer. I cannot go outside. If you will, yeah, uh, yeah. Tr- you will go in train. You will po- feel hot spots in that. But in winter, you can travel. <laughs> yes. Yes. And um, and what is the famous food in your state? In my city, everything is famous. If you will come Delhi, na, you will uh, eat everything. Like the South yes, Indian, yes. South Indian, Chinese fast food. Everything is here. But in West Bengal is uh, in West Bengal, uh, most of the people are Bengali person. They always like rasgulla, rasgulla sandesh. Yeah. Ha 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 ha. Rasgulla. <laughs> West Bengal. Right. Do you know Tarak? Do there is a one uh, show Tarak Mata ka Ultra Chashma? Have you listened? Tarak Mata ka Ultra Chashma. Oh. It come in Sony sub, uh, Sony TV, and There is a Babita. She is from West Bengal. Oh yes, I did not know also. Okay. And ma'am, have you visited? Have you visited in West Bengal? No, I didn't go there. So in And future you, maybe I can go and, there. Yes, yes. And have you visited any another state in our country? You know, when I was uh, when I was. Um, Ah, uh, when I was my mother' house, so there is no any need. Uh, you cannot go outside. 
because my father is from village so he is totally uh, different mindset you cannot go anywhere without my permission and now i came my husband house so now i have a, a different responsibilities now i have to take care of my in laws permission and now yes yes so that but, but hmm. before also before also you lived you lived in village area right now also you are living in town area but uh, what uh, what is uh, what do you think what is the better village area or town area town area is very uh, b- better for me um, <laughs> the mind why? in why? Uh, you know when i live in a city so their mindset is totally different from village per village area they i live in a so whenever i am i am free whenever i am not doing anything so there is a person who say who motivates me why are you free why are you sleepy you can do anything else for yourself you can improve any skill like you are resting all the time why, what are you doing <laughs> <laughs> yes. so neighbors are also like this uh, they are motivates me to do something some kind of some kind uh, things for myself they always motivates me yes and you are living mm. in a city area also there are uh, there are many good school also available and there are many hospital is near your uh, near your house yeah it is mm-hmm. good for mm-hmm. facility in city area but you are living in village area there is no good school there is no good hospital yeah yes if suppose that if i am I, i mean if i will uh, engage my phone in the village so they will say what are you doing this this is not good for things uh, you are daughter in law in this house and now you will running your phone it's not enough you can do nothing else so their mentality is totally different they don't want to engage your phone uh, and ma'am uh, do you know do you know ielts examination about do you know about ielts examination Yes, I know that that is English. Totally, it depends on English subjects. And but if you will crack IELTS exam, you will get uh, you will be English teacher, or you can uh, I uh, heard about on YouTube IELTS yes, exam. Yes, yes. And that is very difficult. That exam is yes, very yes. difficult for English learners. Yes, yes. Mm. And uh, ma'am, also, matter what is your goal? seriously i want to tell uh, seriously uh, this is my goal i want to earn from youtube <laughs> yes, yes, yes. right now this is my short term goal and and after that if i will start earning from youtube so then i will make my second third goal after that but this is my first goal to earn and how long have you been running your youtube channel i started my youtube channel 7 months ago but in 2 months i get rest and because at that time my phone was not good so yes. now i brought a new phone for me so i continue i am making videos and i am uploading on my videos on my channel so that is my goal yes yes and mm. ma'am i am asking i want to i want to ask one question in english related uh, what do you think what is the most important part what is the better part uh, thinking english or uh, translating english thinking english is good for me uh, according to me think, thinking is translating if you how much you can translate you can make mistake also but yes, i yes. will choose thinking english thinking english is the better process also but uh, when you start your english speaking then that time also you have to translate yeah hmm if you are a beginner if you are a learner always you have to translate right yes yes and ma'am also i belong to village area uh, and uh, as mm-hmm. i have told before also when i was starting in my school life that time my english was not good and that's why also mm-hmm. i i don't have a lot of vocabulary yeah and while mm-hmm. speaking also i get stuck because of vocabulary but uh, after mm-hmm. uh, right now also i am talking with you but after conversation also i was thinking uh, it was very easy but that time also it does not come in my mind uh, i mm-hmm. i always uh, i always facing this problem but how did you improve your vocabulary skill how have you improved sorry sir what did you say how did you improve how did you improve your vocabulary skill whenever i get whenever i am stuck in any kind of uh, suppose that i want to say something to you and that word particular word it is not coming on my mind so i started google i started to check on google so that at that time i got it then i was um, clear okay this this thing is uh, which i can call this thing is that so this thing is happening i am doing with myself yes yes 
Oh. All right, ma'am. Also, you are speaking very well. It is nice conversation. Also, yeah. Yes. All right. All right. Nice to meet you. Take care. Bye bye. Have a good day. Thank you so much.